This lens, it's a game changer. It's a new lens and it's a next level lens. It's a next level lens for the Fujifilm X mount and for other mounts. But I want to share with you in this video why this is next level. I'm really impressed with this lens and I will share with you my review after using it a lot. Let's talk about this now. Hi there and welcome to my channel. My name is Tudor Matescu and in this video I want to share with you my thoughts about this brand new lens. A new lens for the Fujifilm X mount that was really really needed. It's a 56mm lens and why it's needed? Because we also have Sigma 56mm f1.4, we also have Viltrox 56mm f1.4, we also have Fujifilm 56mm f1.2, two lenses, two versions. But, but if you are a Fujifilm shooter and if you used all these lenses, you'll find some frustration for everyday shooting and for shooting a lens on a 40 megapixel sensor. Not all these lenses are resolving the 40 megapixel sensor of Fujifilm X-T5, just the 56mm f1.2 WR big chunky lens with some heft to it and with slow AF. This is the one. This is TT Artisan 56mm f1.8 lens. And don't worry that it's an f1.8 lens. The bokeh and the subject to background separation is wow. It's really, really wow. I don't know what they've did, but I will compare this lens to my Sigma in this video just a little and in another future more. But it's wow. So let's talk about this lens and why, why it's a next step lens and why it's a game changer. First of all, this lens is top-notch build quality, full metal with a good weight. It's not heavy, but it's also not light. The weight is perfect. And what do I mean when I'm saying perfect? I was always complaining that the X-T5 has some weight to it and I'm not okay with the balance of the weight of X-T5. So I'm looking for small light lenses on X-T5. So this is the one. This lens is balancing perfect on X-T5. Perfect. So huge deal here. Because if this lens is balancing perfect on X-T5, this also means that it's balancing perfect on X-T30 and also on X-Pro3 and other Fujifilm bodies. So regarding weight, size, this lens is perfection for a Fujifilm shooter that is looking at such details. So perfection regarding build quality, size and weight, really, really loving it. And also you have this square metal lens hood that it's very well built, very strong from SIG materials. And also this lens is made from SIG materials. So next, why this lens is a game changer? This lens is coming from TT Artisan that it's new in manufacturing AF lenses. Not very new, but pretty new. And this lens regarding the AF, it's crazy, crazy good. It's crazy good. I had no problems in using this lens by night, by day, with fast moving subjects, in hard lighting conditions, and the lens on X-T5, it was blazing fast and blazing accurate. I'd say better than Sigma. Boom. Big deal here, big deal here. So, great AF, nothing to complain about it. Uh, the eye AF is working okay. I didn't have any lag uh, when the eye was in focus for confirming. So, it worked great in very hard lighting conditions. By night, indoors, outdoors. So, nothing to complain about the AF. I've tried many 56mm lenses, how I've said, but this I like the most regarding the AF. And we'll see immediately how I've said about the image quality. So AF, nothing to complain about, really, really nothing. And by the way, I have a special newsletter dedicated to the passionate photographer. So if you want to learn more about photography tips, tricks and all kinds of useful information for free, please subscribe to my newsletter, link in the comments and description. Now let's talk about the image quality, how this lens is performing for portraits, for street photography, for event photography, for detailed shots, for detailed shots, because this lens 
Good, very good news. It has a minimum focus distance of 0.5 meters, 50 centimeters. So it's focusing very, very close, very close. It's amazing. Really, really good minimum to focus distance. Next, coatings. Very good. It doesn't flare like the 35 meters F1.8 from TT Artisan. And I was struggle to get in some flare. So regarding flare, it's at another level. At another, at totally another level. Another thing that struck me, again, I'm not looking for these details. I'm just sharing with you my experience and what I'm observing. I'm not looking for these details. But if a lens it strikes me with a good quality or a bad quality, I'm sharing it with you. So it struck me the fact that it has amazing contrast. The contrast is amazing, very modern, very nice looking contrast. You feel the coatings, you feel the good image quality from this lens, from this glass. So no flare, good contrast, good colors, really loving the colors. This is a next level lens for TT Artisan, but also for Fujifilm shooters. Because regarding image quality, my opinion is that this lens it's great. It has enough sharpness, very good sharpness, very, very good sharpness. Again, I'm feeling the sharpness is better than Sigma. I need to test it more. But from what I'm feeling, it's ticking all the image quality boxes that I want for my lens. So good contrast, good colors, micro contrast and bokeh and melted background bokeh for subject to background separation. It's amazing. The background that it's out of focus, it's very nice melted. I was always thinking how this lens, it's just an F1.8 lens, when I'm feeling that I'm getting the same subject to background separation as an F1.4 lens. So I was shocked how good this F1.8 can be. So really good, really, really good. So image quality, top notch, great image quality, nothing to complain for detailed shots, for portraits, for street photography, for even photography, low light, indoors, and so on and so on. So great image quality, no flare issues, great coatings, or it's really, really great and at a great price, at a great TT Artisan price. Now, let me compare just a little this lens with Sigma 56mm f1.4. I've decided to include this comparison because I want to show you this. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> do, do you see it? Yes, do you see it? f1.4 lens, Sigma. Look how chunky it is and it has some weight to it. And 56 from TT Artisan. F1.8. Well, regarding image quality, I feel this is better. I am feeling that this lens is flaring under the Sigma. It's flaring under the Sigma. Also, I'm feeling the image quality, it is better than Sigma. And size, weight, and price are better, are better for my opinion than Sigma. And I've used Sigma a lot. And unfortunately, I wanted to shoot a lot of 56 millimeters on streets, but I didn't bring Sigma with me because of the AF, it's slow. And also because of the image quality, I didn't felt it on Fujifilm X-T5, but also on other bodies because it was hard for me to get the subject in focus and it was hard. This is why I've bought a 90 millimeters on a full frame. But now this is the one. This is your go-to 90 millimeter lens, 85 millimeters field of view equivalent lens for the Fujifilm system. Also, it's not blocking the optical viewfinder of the X-Pro3, X-Pro2 cameras. So this is your go-to lens for everyday photography if you want to make pictures like Sao Lighter or if you like this field of view that is very great for portraits, for finer photography, for detailed shots and so on. But on Fujifilm, till now, the only good option probably was the 56 mm of Fujifilm. But look at the price of that lens. Look how chunky is that lens and look how big is that lens. We didn't have the capable everyday 85 mm lens. This is it. This is the one. So I'm totally recommending it. You have no quality compromises here. So this is very important. You have a great lens without any quality compromises at a great price. So 
I'm really happy that we have such a lens on the Fujifilm system. Again and again, I was always saying that we don't have lenses on Fujifilm. Lenses that we have on full frame. Now, this is your go-to lens for the 56mm choice. The rendering is great, the AF is great, the image quality is great, and no quality compromises regarding flare, minimum focus distance, and so on. So, a totally great lens. I'm really recommending this lens. Please check the links in the comments and description where you can buy this lens at a special price from TT Artisan. Now, please like my video, share my video with your friends, leave me a comment, and please go and check the links and get this lens for you. You will Totally, totally love it. No quality compromises and great, great, amazing AF and image quality.